Hey everyone, Mango Seven Roll here. How we doing today? Welcome to another episode of Aurora Legend, a game I played for funsy and ended up loving the heck out of it. I am level 55 now. You can see me going. I've got my fish, my two kitty girls, and my Natsu there. Uh, loving it to death. Uh, if you want to play this game, there's a link in the description below. You can download it from. I would really appreciate if you use that if you did. Uh, but we are getting an update coming up on the 5th. And this update looks insane. I'm going to show you some pretty exciting things. There's so many things coming. Um, I'll let you read through this if you want. I'll have it in the link description below as well. But they're having a day and night replacement effect, which is really cool. Um, lots of interactive slash fun event styles. Like you can see in the screenshots, there's so much going on. Um, the most important part are the heroes, though, as uh, it always is, and we'll get to them soon. You can just see how big this update is. There are a bajillion things, and um, that's why I don't want to go through it all on uh, the video. It's just supposed to be a quick little fun interaction here. And look how much stuff. There's the event shop. Holy, they just keep going. It just keeps going. This is one big event coming through, um, but we don't care about this, right? Like, obviously we care about this. You get some pretty sweet rings too for the units. The rings are super great. Um, but what we do care about are the characters coming. And um, they've shown some of the characters, and this is the first one, Sariel. You're also getting Michaela here, and I can show you them in game in a second too. They're not in the game yet, but we can see them in the museum, which is where you kind of see all the different characters. Here's a closer look, and the cool part of this, some of you people who are familiar with VAs will notice these names. Yoshino Nanjo, I'm sorry for butchering your name, and Ri Kugimiya. Um, I showed this on stream yesterday and people flipped, so I decided to see uh, kind of where they're from and what they voice. So we can see we are on um, Ri Kugimiya right now. She voices so many things. She voices happy in fairy tale. Um, she voices, what else? Like, there's so many things. Look at this, look at this. Momo from Food Wars. There's so many things. Like, it doesn't end. It doesn't end. It just literally doesn't end. There are so many things. Oh, she voices girl in Pokemon Generations. Heck yes to that. Um, Beatrice Flower Child. I don't know who that is. Don't slap me for that. Um, there are infinity things. And they keep going back. Like, these are some high tier VAs here and we'll see as we hit a couple of these um because in Persona 4 she is Rize or Rise I'm not sure how to say her name Rizet uh you all know her if you've played Persona 4 she's also Anne from JoJo's have not watched JoJo's don't hurt me for that too I I hope you don't um and again this is one thing I notice when I play games right now especially with like the type of community we have here is so many people care about the VAs and artists like, it is the most important thing, I think, for gacha games now is getting really high tier VAs, and they've definitely done it here. Um, ooh, she's even in Polar Bear Cafe. Like, look at this, Toradora. This is the important one. Um, Taiga Asaka, I don't know how to say that name. Yori Minase, I have some of her um, anime figures as well from Idolmaster. Super cool. Um, I think this is the one people said was the original Sundere. I'm not sure. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm not well versed in anime like you guys are. I'm just a, uh, I'm just a new, new little lonely person that doesn't know too much. Magna Carta 2, that was an interesting game. We're all the way back into 2008 here. Like, look at this, Palam and Purim in Final Fantasy IV. Like, how cool is that? Like, it just doesn't end. It literally doesn't end. Like, this is a high tier, super super high tier. VA right now. Anyway, I'll let you search the rest all the way back to 2001. Like, I can't even believe that. That's so far back. Um, also, let's go for the next one. And this one I'm excited about. This is Yoshino Nanjo, who voices... Um, which one did she voice? Sariel. Uh, and she sees some idols there. She's the Elia Ayase voice from Love Live. One of my top tier waifus in that show. I think she's like number three i think maybe number two um there's so many other things she's in stella glow too lizette i've not actually played stella glow but the music is fantastic but most importantly she is ellie and i freaking love ellie and there's so many other things here we'll just scroll down not as big as the other one but still impressive 
Um, anyway, to show you the third one that's coming in, let's go onto the right side screen here. We'll go into the museum. And just to show you their art here, this is Michaela. This is her in-game sprite, uh, her illustration here, just like that. Her beautiful voice you can listen to as well. And you can even see her skills if you're interested. Um, she is a super duper tank. She uh, decreases the skill damage and status effect damage of all opponents by 25% for 25 seconds. That is insane. Um, a lot of other cool things there. That's the one we are getting. We are also getting, where is she? Um, she's down here somewhere. Vegil, Vegil Riel, Voice of Bloom, and she is adorable. This is one of my favorite arts too. I can't believe they didn't showcase her because this art is just super cute with all the petals and the flowers and everything. Super love that. Her VA is, does it show her VA here? I wanna click the X, perfect. Um, her VA, Yoshino, oh, it's another Yoshino Nanjo. So there's two, two voiced by her. That's kind of weird. Two in one patch voiced by the same person. I mean, she's voicing Ellie, so I will not argue with that. And we missed the third one. Serial, there we go. Um, and here is Serial. There's her thing. She buffs other angels. Like, I love that. One of her skills legit uh, buffs other angels. I think it's this one. Um, no, it's this one. Yeah, when Serial is present, the effect of healing on all angels increased by 20%. I don't know. I just think that's so cool to have, like, a creature-type angel in a game like this. Um, yeah, so that's about it for this patch. Uh, there's going to be lots coming. It's coming out on the 5th, and I'm really excited for it. So uh, definitely join me there if you can. Again, link in the description below if you want to play. Uh, super appreciate y'all being here. I'm going to try to put out a summon video, too, for this, because I'm going to be summoning... For whatever one um, is the limited. I think it's Michaela, but we'll see. So thank you so much. Uh, feel free to like, comment, subscribe as always. And I'll talk to you later. Bye, everybody.